Now to the return of the LA Rams as they took on the Denver Broncos tonight. The team was hoping to continue its winning streak during the preseason. I know, we really wanted them to win, mm. but as exciting as it was, KKL 9's Jeff Nguyen shows us win or lose, the fans showed some real team spirit. Based on enthusiasm, you may not know who lost during Saturday's matchup between the Rams and the defending Super Bowl champs, the Denver Broncos. Chris Savallo says he's proud of the L.A. reboot to his team. This team has potential. They're young, they're hungry. Regardless, tonight's matchup didn't really count. That's because it was the third preseason game, which is more like a dress rehearsal. Was, I saw the first couple games. I'm actually really excited. This Rams fan club filled big wangs in North Hollywood for the televised away game. Members also meet here for home games because they can catch a round trip party bus to the LA Coliseum for $30. There's no drinking and driving and you know it's the bus driver's job to get us there and get us back safely. Back in LA after 21 years, diehard fans say the team's owner made the return happen after offering to build a new privately financed stadium. We deserve a team. The Rams were our team. Chris Abayos says he grew up without an NFL team here at home, but that's not the case for his daughter Sammy. It gives me a chance to share it with my family now. Now that I can pass it on to my daughter and, and give them the give them what I was not able to experience, and it's it's amazing. This Rams club says that they like to meet at this bar because it's just a block away from the metro station, which makes things very convenient for them. In North Hollywood, Jeff Nguyen, KCAL 9 News.